Here in Billings, the sound of music has been ongoing for 100 years. The Billings Music Teacher Association turns local students into musicians every day, including me. Since 1924, music teachers have gathered together to teach music from infants to elders. Seeing students joy on their faces when they've learned a new piece or when they've learned a new skill. I think that is the most exciting thing. Therese Bertrand is the current president of the Billings Music Teachers Association. She's been teaching music for over 41 years. Ta, 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 ta. She works with Anna Rodriguez teaching the next generation music. It has been the most beneficial to get together with other musicians and play in different music camps different duets, ensembles. Although Bertrand and Rodriguez teach any age of students, their pride and joy comes from teaching young children the delights of music. And then like with, with my little ones, just seeing their response in their eyes to music like this little one-year-old that I'm working with, her, her eyes just, it, it, it's just really neat. It just makes me excited. But others do begin learning music much later in life, a perhaps more unconventional path and one that for Bertrand begins with the conversation. I always, I always have people come and talk to me first. I always see what I ask them what they're looking for and then I have policies that I go through and if it's a good fit, fine. If it's not a good fit, then that's fine too. Besides being a good fit, the most important thing a new student can bring is a positive attitude and an ADA key acoustic piano. The rest is up to the imagination. And with 100 years down and plenty more to go, neither Rodriguez or Bertrand plan on quitting anytime soon. To see them come in and they don't know anything about music and then just a couple months down the line they'll start composing their own pieces, singing all the time, and you can tell that they just are gaining that joy in music. In Billings, Matt Carmack, MTN News.